Hey, what is up everyone? Welcome back to another Master Grade review, and today I'll be checking out the Master Grade Wing Gundam TV version. Just like so many, Gundam Wing was my first introduction to the Gundam franchise back in the day when it aired on the Toonami block on Cartoon Network, and still to this day is one of the most unique animes I have ever watched. The main Gundam rarely sees any screen time unless it's getting wrecked, Hiro Yui is hell-bent on killing himself, and unlike most series, the main characters swap back and forth, piloting multiple mobile suits and Gundams. Usually main characters just stick to one, and in Gundam Wing, it's all over the place. The Wing Gundam right here is developed from the Wing Zero, which was initially developed from the Tall Geese. But besides the Tall Geese and Epion, the Master Grade Wing Gundam TV version is the only TV show accurate mobile suit. And even at that, it's not necessarily all that accurate. Bandai has given this model kit right here a more conventional Gundam look. Not that thick, bulky look from back in the day. The color accuracy here is fantastic, with only some minor inaccuracies like right here in the wing thrusters, but that's about it. However, I have to say that the eye sticker on this kit looks like actual ass. I've never seen white used on a master grade eye sticker before, and never, and I mean never hope to see it again. This just looks cheap and lazy. Besides that, on the whole, if you're looking for a 1 100 scale model of the main suit from Gundam Wing, you cannot do any better than this. So there is the Master Grade Gundam Wing with everything that it comes with. Just like with all the other Master Grade Gundam Wing kits, the fingers are those swap outable type and what we've got in here, we've got those standard default fists which are attached to the kit, widespread open fingers, some trigger fingers, as well as some fingers for holding the beam saber. We also have the buster rifle in here that is in the kind of metallic gun metal that this kit is in. We've got some yellow down here, the splits at this part. Of course there is the buster rifle's three shots, you can pull them off if you want to. And that handle can move slightly up and down like that. Of course, we've also got the shield that has the part for attaching the forearm on the back, as well as this handle for attaching into the hand that can move around. This opens at that point, beam saber is stored in there, and closes up like that. As for the beam saber, it's just a simple handle and curved green beam. Moving on to the articulation, and as for the head, that's just a simple ball joint. Shoulders can move up and down slightly. As for the arm at the shoulder, that can move out like that. There it is, all the way up. Of course, that arm can rotate all the way around. Bend at the elbow. The thumb right there, that is on a ball joint, so you can move that around. Wrist also on a ball joint. Like with older Master Grades, a barely there ab crunch and side to side. Not much at all. Front skirting armor up. Side skirt, butt flap. Leg all the way up to the front all the way up to the back, all the way out for the splits, rotation at the thigh, bend at the knee, thruster, ankle armor, the joint at the ankle all the way around, all the way up to the back, side to side, quite good. Of course, lastly, the bend at the toe. Also, of course, because this is Wing Gundam, that means we've got a transformation. So there is bird mode and that is it for the review. What can I say, this reminds me of simpler times when Master Grades came out quite often and they were simple and they were solid. If you're looking for a highly detailed Master Grade, this isn't one right here, but it is a very nice build and the final product looks and feels great. The mobile suit itself as well as bird mode look fantastic, well, just don't look at bird mode from the bottom. But all in all, it is very nice. This is a baseline master grade. It's not great at anything in particular, and it's not terrible at anything in particular, but it looks like what you want it to look like. And if you're a fan of Wing, then this is one you just have to have. But anyway, as always, thank you very much for watching. Leave a like if you'd like to see more videos like this. And as always, I'll see you next time.